Welcome back, guys, to my playthrough of Leaf. I am Adormus, and this is my channel, Adormus Gaming. Although you already knew that because you wouldn't be here if you didn't already know. But I felt like saying that anyway. So we have just discovered not everyone is starting to play well because the supply drops are soon to stop. And they uh, didn't number crunch enough in time, it seems like, and the process of doing everything they were doing here is taking longer than they eventually wanted which led to the downfall of the facility and we're here apparently discovering what the hell happened to everybody yay note from Andrew Fisher it was soon discovered that if a pathfinder with has a vision of their own death it is the fact that them actually dying instead of remaining dead they branch into a new wave of reality whereupon they continue to live, albeit at the cost of the equivalent amount of life within that branch. To put it plainly, if a Pathfinder wears the leaf suit, dies through some accident, their death is treated with the life of a nearby living thing. They achieve quantum immortality. A uh, note from Andrew Fisher, effectively those wearing deny the actual wave function collapse. In other words, the ability to branch through various objective realities a part of a many world theory of quantum mechanics with this ability pathfinders have visions of themselves dying each time this occurs something nearby dies such as an animal or nearby vegetation okay then uh note from andrew fisher when i met einstein at prince prince it's princeton <laughs> sorry i couldn't help but see a hint of Oppenheimer reflected in him. I was astonished by his clairvoyance into the makeup of our universe, viewing the experience of all things natural and spiritual in perfect unison, with the self acting as little more than an optical illusion in the perpetual flow of the universe. This shit, when Oppenheimer, 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 uh, and I studied Indiology under Arthur Ryder, I could see that same compassion and empathy for all living creatures brewing within him. Okay, I'll be right back. And I'm back. Sorry about that, guys. I had severe cotton mouth and needed to remedy that. Needed to... Shut up, phone! Okay, so... Uh, note from a researcher. Quantum death and immortality using leaf technology is a fascinating field of study. Using this tech, a person could live out a full life without fear of accident cutting it an accident cutting it short. Albeit the use of immortality is a misnomer 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 I don't know that word as the user simply shifts to a new timeline wherein they are still alive. This can only hold true until all practical timelines are exhausted. For example, an elderly man dying of natural causes is unlikely to shift into timeline where they do not die is, as that parallel world is very unlikely to exist. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay, so what I'm getting is that means every time we die we are dead and the reality we just left we die that first time I drown and that reality I am dead but you take over the conscience of your body double in a multiverse and only when you run out of doubles in the multiverse or if your death is just that certain as they just said that the elderly man dying of a specific disease or illness will in inevitably still die so they don't get to move on whereas we I guess with that suit we get to body snatch our doubles from other ultimate alternate realities holy shit Batman get on this immediately that was actually kinda cool why am I down here where am I supposed to go oh over here Thank you, Toucan Sam. I'm getting a hang of that. 
I am getting the hang of that. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Okay, wait a minute. No, 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 no. Oh, really? Okay. There's really nothing up there. I thought there were doors, well, openings, but they were just a doors. The natural life here seems to be slowly dwindling. No shit. Edwin thinks I'm crazy, but I see it becoming quieter. Are we gradually killing this place? <laughs> Clearly, you can't die. You, you you can't cheat death. I mean, Full Metal Alchemist brought that shit full circle. Equivalent exchange. What if I go down here? Can I get back up? I hope so. Oh god, I'm pressing the big red button. Go back over here though and see what I may have missed. Oh come on, there we go. Requires 26 acorns. Are you fracking serious? I have missed acorns. And that was the way I came. Okay, so I may be missing some shit here. But I really don't know if I want a 100% completionist this guy. More or less just trying to get through it with you guys so you can enjoy it and I can just move on to different things. If you guys want me to do a different playthrough and try to 100% everything, that'll probably come at a later date. Some downtime where I don't know what I should record. And I'll have, uh, I'll give a poll. And the three people that watch me can, can take that poll. Okay, the orbs that grow within the valley yield vast deposits of energy. Pendulum aims to win the war by harnessing this energy using the life seed. Bombs created using this energy have the potential to destroy entire cities. Of course, instead of, you know, using this energy for other shit, you want to make a bomb. Get where you need faster with the push rod piston maximum velocity upgrade. Who names this shit? Our newly developed push rod piston will allow pathfinders to achieve an unprecedented velocity. By energizing the tunnel rails, the leaf suit should conduct enough energy to reach immense speed. Gotta go faster, dun 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 dun, gotta go faster, dun 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 dun, dun. gotta go faster, 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 faster. Ludicrous speed! Woo! So 
I'm not talking much, but this is too much fucking fun. Oh my god, I don't know how the fuck I just survived that and did that, but we did it. We did it! I thought I was dead there for sure. Okay, that was the single most badass moment in any video game I have ever fucking played. Sorry I was quiet, but I was enjoying the shit out of that. That music, that score was amazing. All of that. Absolutely amazing. I had chills. Oh my god. Alright guys, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for enjoying this if you are. Oh god, I am. I'm, I got fucking chills. Alright. <laughs> uh, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment. Love criticism. I can't get better without you guys' help and support. Let me know what I'm doing right or wrong. Anyway, that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.